What is up everybody? It's your girl Stephanie and thanks for joining me again. And if you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Steph and on this channel we talk about everything fragrance. So without further ado, we're going to hop in you guys. I love using perfume oils to layer my fragrances. All of these you guys are my favorites. All of these products that I'm going to be talking about today have been gifted but that will never sway my opinion. I am always going to be truthful on this channel what I like, what I don't like. There is still more perfume oils that I have, but I'm just not a fan of them. So I'm gonna be showing you guys the ones that I absolutely adore and love. I'm gonna show you guys how I use them, pretty much how I incorporate them into my routine. Okay, so the first one, okay, that I wanna talk to you guys about, I have two of them from this brand. It is the brand Nest. And the first one that I'm gonna be talking about is South Pacific Sandalwood. This fragrance oil right here, I would say is more for the girlies who love their woody fragrances. You gotta love your sandalwood because this is, this is a very, very woody, oh my gosh. This is like a little bit, it has a little bit of this green nature to it almost, but the dry, the deep dry down of this is like, it is so addictive. I am a sandalwood lover through and through, so this is totally right up my alley. This lasts so long on the skin. It warms up nicely. It even becomes a little bit lactonic to my nose. So you squeeze the top, and then, you know, it has a dropper. I love that they're, like, aesthetically pleasing. They're going to look so nicely on your vanity. So this perfume oil right here has notes of sandalwood, violet, and vetiver. Perfume oils are perfect layering tools. So if you want to add a little bit more of like a woody touch to a fragrance, something like this is so perfect to add to your collection. So the next one that I have is going to be for my vanilla lovers through and through. And this one is called Madagascar Vanilla. And it is from the same brand. And again, you guys, the dropper and everything, I feel like it looks so luxurious. You can literally just add it onto your skin. It sinks in so nicely. One of those girlies with like healthy, radiant skin, like look at that, look at that, sh like that shine with the lighting I've got going on. Oh, there's something in here that's different. It doesn't smell like a typical, like just like a typical vanilla or sugary vanilla. So let me read to you guys the notes of this one actually. This one has notes of vanilla bean, vanilla orchid, and coconut. It does have a coconutty tropical vibe, but I get predominantly coconut and vanilla. And I think that something like this would layer so beautifully with like Alien Goddess from Mugler also with the intense version of that one also so I think I'm on to something I may have to use that that combo today because I'm not wearing fragrance right now <laughs> the dropper is so convenient you can get any unscented lotion oh fill up the whole dropper you know a good handful of lotion drop it in there and go to town all over your body after your shower and girl guaranteed you will smell delicious. From the next uh, fragrance company, I am going to be talking about Oil and & Oud, and they did send me these for review, and actually it was for Instagram. They sent me a total of six, but these were the three that just spoke to me. These three, y'all, oh my gosh. Bad B is, oh my goodness, this is so good. <laughs> I love layering this one with a Skylar fragrance that I have called Capri Summer and it's like a fruit bomb on my body. You can honestly go to town with these two if you want, you know. I absolutely just love putting it on my pulse points, putting it behind the neck and then just going in with my fragrance. I love layering these. has notes of blackberry, raspberry, oak moss, vanilla, amber, and it is so good. Like the combination of these notes is incredible. I know that cherry has been the note of the of the year 
Okay, I feel like Cherry has been in so many different fragrances. This one right here is called Cashmere Cherry. This literally smells like if you're eating some cherries. Oh my gosh. To me, this doesn't smell like cough syrup, like a cherry Merlot. I feel like that's, that's a little too much for me. And the person who runs their Instagram, you guys, they are so, they are such a pleasure to communicate with. And I feel like that's important. Um, as a customer, you just, you want to be appreciated. So it has cashmere cherry and almond, plum, red rose, jasmine, sandback, tonka bean, vanilla, cinnamon, sandalwood, cloves, and cedar. Are you kidding me? And I've worn this by itself. This literally lasts all day long. I actually want to try putting this on lotion so like literally my whole body smells of this. And last but not least, we have Citrus Moi. So this is like a gorgeous, uplifting, fresh, citrusy fragrance oil. And you guys know citruses do not last, but this one, y'all, this one lasts so freaking long. So the notes to this are grapefruit, pomelo, orange, lemon, and lime, orange blossom, and musk. Perfect for hot weather. You know, if you're a citrus baddie like I am, I freaking love citrus heavy fragrances. It, they're just totally my vibe, totally what I'm into, especially for the hot heat. We're getting a heat wave right now, you guys. I am filming early today because I'm I'm literally, I, I want to get videos for you guys, but I also don't want to die. <laughs> this is fantastic. Lasts all day. And obviously, when these warm up to your skin, you guys, they're going to project. All of these. All of these. I smell so yummy. <laughs> Last but not least, we have some from Oil Perfumery, and these were gifted slash I did get a compensation for talking about them. I don't get a compensation for talking about them in this video, but um, I did want to mention three. The first one that I have right here is their impression of Tamarindo from Memo Paris. And because of this oil, I really want to add that fragrance to my collection. Tamarindo has that Coco Mademoiselle vibe. But this, this one just goes to a way more tropical level. It's so well balanced. It's so classy. But it's like, it's giving beach goddess vibes. It's giving vacation luxury. Then we have um, Matcha Meditation from Maison Margiela. So right out of here, I was like, oh, this doesn't really smell too similar, right? So I, I wore it on my skin, I tested it out, and I was like, wait a second, this does smell like it. It's just less citrusy. I, I felt like the uh, original, you get a big blast of citrus. Uh, like, it's the white chocolate, the matcha that comes in. But it's such a short-lived fragrance, you guys. Like, the matcha and the white chocolate disappear, and then you're left with all the florals and musk. So... As much as I love the Maison Margiela version, it just, like I said, it just doesn't last. This one, on the other hand, lasts the whole entire wear. I get the matcha and I get the white chocolate. And I'm not gonna lie, you guys, I actually prefer the oil to the original fragrance. This would be a great transitional fragrance from going into summer to fall. Their version of Meliora from Parfums de Marly. 100%. 100%. This is spot on. And Meliora, you guys, it's such a shame because it's such a pretty, fruity, very classy, sophisticated fragrance, but it doesn't last first. So if you have Meliora already, and you're like, man, I just wish it lasted longer. Please do yourself a favor and get this one. They are literally 100% identical. If you want to smell good all day, you guys, 
layer with them, add them to your lotion. This isn't my personal tip. I didn't come up with this. I actually saw it on TikTok from a girl. Um, her name is, she has such a cute little name, but it's called Smelly Hose Only. So go ahead and check her out, you guys, at Smelly Hose Only. And what she said is that she loves to get her perfume oils, which I think it's such a great idea. She'll rub it all on the palm of her hand to get like enough. Do you guys see that? We ain't playing around here, okay? We want to smell good. She goes like this and then she just adds it to her hair like that. And then you go on about your day and you give people a good whiff of your fragrance. Not only that, but it'll give your hair, it'll also give your hair some shine. That is the end of my video. If you enjoyed this, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe down below and activate that bell so you're notified every single time that I post. Don't miss out on any more videos from your girl, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and stay so good. Bye.